Oh, man, so great to see you. You have a really nice house? Yeah, we have a couple friends come through. Usually, we just eat some chitlins and drink Hennessy. <laughs> but today, we're talking about fighting. <laughs> <laughs> it takes a crazy mother to get hurt and be like, I think I'm, I'm gonna do it again. What made you want to be a fighter? It's a good question, but I just feel like <laughs> everyone has that fight and stay inside them. Mm -hmm. but when I was getting into it, I saw my coach knock some guy out. <laughs> <laughs> that was the coolest shit. <laughs> he was my hero at the time, and I was like, I want to do that to someone. Did you used to get into, like, bar fights at clubs <laughs> and stuff? I tried not to. <laughs> Didn't want to get in trouble. Like, what hurts more, a, a shin kick or just, like, a, a punch to the face? I think blocking a kick. Yeah, that is hurts the, more. Because if you think about it, you're kicking their leg, but when you're blocking, it's yeah, like it's... your shin on their shin. Yeah. So <sighs> I've had lots of bruises, but nothing really. Yeah, no, a lot of blood. No. That's one thing that's so nasty to me. Well, my nose bleeds all the time when I'm in the fight. You oh. just like tap it, my nose starts bleeding. And I've saw a few of my fights and I'm like painting my face with the blood and oh. now I'm like, nah, I'll probably not do that because it looks worse than it is. Why do you think we like to watch fighting in general? I mean, who doesn't want to watch two people go toe to toe <laughs> and <laughs> see some blood? <laughs> Sometimes there's a lot of shit talking yeah. between the two people, so I think a lot of people are drawn to that kind of drama. I noticed you don't feed into that a lot. You're not really like a big shit talker. <laughs> yeah, can you imagine me talking shit? I think that's real intimidating. With that voice, somebody tell you they're gonna kick the shit out of you, I'd be terrified. When I swear, people are like, this sounds funny coming from your voice, like, hey, Bitch, yeah. take me down. <laughs> I'm getting back to my feet or I'm submitting you. Yeah. How do you get pumped up for a fight? Like, what's the, what you like to do pre-fight to just get you in a mindset? Yeah, I, I like watching my own fights. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. I remember I saw one fight one time. You kicked her in the stomach. And I knew in that moment, like, she had the shit on herself, <laughs> a rear broke, something happened to her. Then you did the most coolest shit I ever saw in my life. Yeah. You need her in the back <laughs> of the thigh, but in my mind, I want to say you need her in the ass, because that just sounds so much cooler. I did. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do after a fight? Do you still have that adrenaline rush, and you like... I'm, like, usually exhausted. I want to be in my room, no one talk to me, <laughs> just bring me the pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Being able to snap of a finger could knock a mother out, but you have to be able to, you know, hold back sometimes. Yeah, like when someone, like, jumps in the line in front of you and yeah, stuff. Yeah. yeah, you know you can, like, kick <laughs> someone in the head, like, <laughs> if they annoy you, but if I'm having a bad day mm -hmm. or, like, someone's pissed me off, like, uh, I just go in and hit the bag or mm -hmm. hit the pads or hit someone. <laughs> no one realizes how great you feel after you've just, like, went toe-to-toe -to -toe with the bag and, like, just rah, get mm -hmm. everything out for you. Like, you can just call me and hit me if you're having a bad day. Oh. I'll let you hit me. I don't really have, like, good standard form. I just have, like, one move and you just call the, the helicopter and you just put your head down and... <laughs> <laughs> you know, you watch World Star and you just see a dude got a hood on like this. You just put the hood, and then you, <laughs> then you just give him, and you give him some of them. <laughs> we have to fix that. I know I'm not the most healthiest person in the world based on my chitlin and Hennessy consumption, <laughs> but I need to know how to get my one-on-one -on -one game up. So I'm gonna need you to show me some moves. Yeah, for sure. Okay. You got any equipment? Oh. I have too much. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Oh. Well, at least you look the part. Think so? I know so. Okay, yeah! Hey, right. so give me a kind of glimpse of what I'm working with. Okay? So. Maybe we should do some elbows. Elbows? Elbow, elbow that'd be like someone. A little, that'd be like crunk dancing, though. Now you like, throw them bows. <laughs> I'm so tired. Hey, Danny, it's been five seconds. <laughs> Are you sure? <sighs> I think I'm going to have a minute. Calm down. I really think it's the shoulder pads that are really helpful. So try and straighten up your punches. And not like this, like you're... Like the cowardly lion? Yeah, <laughs> where you're getting your nails done. So, make a fist and then come forward. No, you're still doing this. I can't help it! 
So if you ever see anyone doing your technique, then you want to knee them up. In the balls? <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Like this? So here? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I said go easy on me. I think I needed that. It shows me everything that I am and everything that I'm not. Oh, Danny. I think it's just great when people just realize what they are in life and just accept those things. So I've made a fighter out of you? <laughs> yeah, I think so. You want to kick me back? No, no, I don't want to kick you, Josh. <laughs> 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 Y'all play too much. <laughs> Thank you so much, JoJo, for coming through and showing me these amazing fight moves that I would definitely use if somebody tried to test my gangster. <laughs> you just have to believe. <sighs> believe, and yes. I can achieve. Yeah. You need to listen to my motivational speeches <laughs> on YouTube. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, JoJo. See ya. Keep working hard. <laughs>